Hi everybody, my name is Premjit Singh. I'm serving on this vessel as a second officer. My vessel name is Motor Vessel Vino. Today I'm going to explain you, brief you, and familiarize you through my video, this video, about the ship, navigational ship bridge equipment. First, I'd like to show you this called the radar. This is ace band radar which detects all the targets like the land, sea and many things which even comes in the range. Now you can see here uh, there is two targets on my head of the ship. This is my ship position and this is the two, pos two more vessel. This vessel I already plotted on the radar, radar and his details is here name of the vessel call sign CPA distance and speed this this is more useful and more important for the navigating officers to navigate in the different situations like the bad weather restricted visibility it gives all information about the targets range speed and everything And this is interface with the many instrument like AIS. AIS called that is identification system, automatic identification system. This is AIS, automatic identification system. It's an instrument. It is the instrument that keeps the data of the all the seat which has fitted with the AIS. It's all information you can find it here. All the ships details like suppose there is seas called Persia. You can come and you can see the details of the Persia. It's name of the ship, MMSI number, call sign, length, rent, course heading everything details is mentioned over here it's a very much useful for navigations and this is interface with the radar this is called the telegraph which keep the movement of the pressure like same like the another vehicle which is speed up the speed it's the it's a panel and from here we increase the speed these are the telephones this is the telephone for communicating to engine room and other internal ships places this is the tachometer which shows the rpm how much rpm revolution per minute of your propeller it's indicated over here it's called the banwas B and W A S. Notice this is the mandatory requirement of IMO, which V and W A S, which means Prince Navigational Watch Alerting System. It has an alarm system and has two sensor in the breeze. When and have a time frame every 10 minutes if there is no movement of the watchkeepers it's keep alarm and make alarm suppose anybody is sleeping last 10 minutes and uh, this system has not found any movement in the place it's make alarm and the watchkeeper get alerted and do his job properly it is the VHF, very high frequency. This used to communicate with the port control, ship to ship. And this is the autopilot, also gyro along with. This is 
this has the three mode, autopilot has three mode. The first mode is, <coughs> the first mode you can see here, it's written, is the hand steering. Like, you can drive this vehicle by the hand, you can change his directions. Another is the autopilot. Here in auto, so autopilot, you can put the vehicle and you need not a man to change your, just you have to press here and you can alter your course and set the course that you want to drive. This is the gyro repeater. It's showing the your heading, present heading. And this is magnetic, magnetic, this magnetic heading that is fitted on the up of the piece. It also shows the, uh, the magnetic direction of magnetic heading of the seal. This is very important in the scenario when the, the autopilot get failure. You can you can uh, you can use this magnetic compass to uh, sail a ship on a heading. For this purpose, we use to get every day basis corrections. What is the difference between the gyro heading and the magnetic heading? That is also important in the scene of failure of your autopilot. There are the many. This is the panel where many alarms are there. Alarms, switches, the same specials. And this is the navigational light panel. Then at, at sea, generally this govern after sunset and before 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 sunrise. These are the lights which very much important for the navigations. All the navigators will understand the meaning of these lights and decide the another vessel directions. This is the other security light spanner this is called the SAC search and rescue transponder it's a very important thing in the distress when you cause any problem like you have to abandon the seat then you must be have carry this with you which help you to find out the uh, rescuer to your exact locations. called sat -C, satellite scene which used for the communications we send masses it, it has all the time network no need internet or like that connection it all the time network in any situation you can send masses as you require and also we receive here uh, we receive here the better masses EGC enhanced group calling, which is interface with this terminal. Here, all the better reports in a day two time broadcast all the nearby course decisions. This is called the uh, PS system, public addressing system, which used to make any important announcement within the seat. You can use this. So the printers which interface with the many instrument. This is MFHF, same like the VHF, which also used in the scenario of distress on other communication, other to communicate with the coast station and other ship. This for the long range. This is the very important panel, water in Greece alarm system, which alarms in the scenario of any 
about an injury in the main leg in some hole. It's alert the duty officer. And this is the water system. There is a section in the seat in the option. Uh, if any flooding come, then here is the options to to you know shut down and drain out the water. This is the panel for the. This is the many publications which is huge for the navigations. It's very most important like the admiralty sailing direction which gives the all country ports information and the best uh, a bay a place passes to going over to another place so is the sky cables and other ALRS admitted lights of radio signal and also pop signals publications is there and this not cultivable as much these all books are very useful for us to keep the vision went to another places and all the navigating officials and the deep officials has a very good knowledge about the these publications where it has to use and when it has to use <coughs> uh, this is the satellite code which rarely we use in the um, emergency we use if we have to call an emergency anywhere we use this satellite phone this is the video very important tools in this in the uh, in the situation of accident it's record all the activities of base equipment and the duty officer all communication is going to record it here if any incident happen there is a cd and the storage which records all activity that can be take out by the authority and the and the analyze the what are the causes of the accident these are the main publication and more publications which also used in the city and this is the chart room like presently i'm going to watch this romania presently i'm here my 12 hundred hour position is here we are following this route and heading towards the black sea this chart like we have the all world charts here arranged here on charts keep their numbers put it here all the world charts are there this is also the product <coughs> This is also a very important alarming system. This is the fire alarm panel. Uh, uh, this generally indicate the duty officers the, from which uh, place of the ship the alarm is coming. Like suppose you are smoking in some unauthorized area or any any uh, fire something happened. This is the all the ship's main accommodation area. Has divided in the zone, and that the zone it's alarm where we have to check what are the causes. It's very important also. Here are the publications. This is the storage of flags and other things. watching my video on youtube my name is prem jit singh just follow me on the youtube twitter and facebook i will upload this video i hope this will help you
little bit to understand the profession. It's called the merchant. Thank you very much.